Guys, it's TBW563 here, along with... SWP. Uh, if you didn't hear him, it's SWP. So, today, we were unboxing the new addition to the tradition and the replacement to my dead recon, because this thing is an idiot, and it dead, and it's dead. Hopefully this one is not. So, we're, um... We're gonna open this priority mail package. Um, good thing I have scissors. Cut, 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 cut through that. Cook shows about the priority mail package. It's not like you would need it. Oh, and it's another parcel. How many parcels do you want this to be? I really, I really yeah. I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel the trapezoidal shape. There's the parcel. Now, unbox the parcel again. Ugh. Click, click. All right. All right. I've gotten into the radio. All right. I'm in. Here we go. Pulling it out. I'm pulling out my CKW now. Ooh. I haven't plugged it in yet, silly. Alright, and... Oh, and it came with its original power jack as well. Ooh. This thing's pretty big. Alright, so now... Pull out the nice little bubble wrap. The antenna is really odd. It's like made out of plastic. Alright. Oh, wow. It feels really nice. Now, this is gonna be the first radio. This is gonna, this is gonna be like the first radio with a statement white. Wait, a statement white. Hold on, let's pull it out here. Ooh, here it is. Emerson Research CKW two thousand. With the pointy, pointy statement light. It's so pointy, so pointy, pointy statement white, pointy. <coughs> Emerson Research, um, looks a lot like an alarm clock. And, specific area message encoding. Thought that was a button, but I guess it isn't. So, now, we're gonna power it on. And then I'll probably do some settings. Oh, wow! Oh, it even came with its own, uh, what is this? It's like a aux cable. It came with, like, some sort of auxiliary cable that you could, like, plug something into. Um, cool. I'm gonna leave that. Um, because we're probably not gonna need it. So Maybe I'll need it for, like, self-activation or something. Although I don't want to self-activate. I don't self-activate. I mean, I, I do it sometimes, but, like, I barely... I don't, like, do it for... Wow, right now. This thing's pretty cool. Now, the screen's black because, uh, I'm trying to, there's a rubber band on this power jack, and I'm trying to get it off here, because it's really cool, or, because it's odd. Anyways, um, I'm going to use, er, uh, just take a look at the thing, PC, just going to use the APC here. Alright, power jack is connected to the outlet now. Time for the big power up. I'm gonna attempt to do this. Try to find the DC jack. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Oh, whoops. Three, two, one. Ta da! Version 13? What the heck? This is a version 13. The version 13 Emerson CKW2. So, 12 o'clock. Oh, it even has a date. Does it have button beeps? Let's see. Tune it. All right. Statement. Oh, it's so pretty. Statement right. So pretty. Okay. Expiration. Wait. Oh, no. Oh, um, the owner didn't, like, unprogram it. Unrecognized message. Look at that. Unknown message. Instead of unrecognized. Unknown message. Unknown message. Blah, 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 blah. 
tuning down, unknown message, aspiration. It's just like the 300. If we go over to my WR300 here, if we push the up key, or the up button, <laughs> I like you advisory. I forgot I programmed that into my 300. What the heck? But I, I I programmed, instead of programming required weekly test, I did I like you advisory for some reason. It's kind of weird. Anyway, apparently this is programmed to single county. I don't want that. I want to program to all counties because you want to get the full EAS. Oh, and what's cool about this is it's a power button. All right, so first, 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 we need to find the settings button. Menu, channel one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, channel seven, channel seven, 1201, um, ALM one, um, I don't want that. Do I, is there a volume button? Stewie's button, there's a dimmer button for the light. I'm not gonna need that. Um, so weird. Select, I don't want that though. Sleep, tuning, hold on, menu. What, how do you do this? This is so weird. Um. Menu. Leave, leave that on muted. Search up a video of how to set it up. I think I, I think I know how to do it. Hold on, we'll we'll figure it out. Um. Huh. Weather slash hazard. So okay, so that. I don't know why we're not getting anything. Um. Hopefully this one isn't dead. Let's see. The antenna is really weird. The antenna is really weird. Um, channel three. Um. Uh. Hold on, give me a sec. Give me a sec. Something. All right. Um. Volume. Is there a volume knob? Oh, here we go. I think I hear it. All right, this is an AM, AM, or FM. Channel one. Don't know why it's... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, band. How do you turn, how do you, I need to stop this so I don't get copyright strike. It doesn't look like we're getting anything off of weather. Maybe because we're in a bad spot. How do you, menu? How do you dang, how do you turn this thing dang off? Wait. Oh, that's cool. Alert off, ALM1. Alright. How do you power? Oh, the power button controls how you turn that. Oh, I'm getting it now. Okay. So wait, menu, set up time. Here we go. Select 12. It is, what time is it? SWP, what time is it? I don't, I ha I don't have a clock on me right now. SWP, what time is it? I don't have a clock. Oh, wait, no, I do. It's 4.04. It's 4.04? It's what? 4.04. error, okay. 4.04. It is 4.04. No, not 4.04 a.m. What? 4.05 now, yes. How do you... 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12... One, two, three, four. For some reason, there's no PM. So, I guess you're just gonna have to guess that it's not a four, four, four PM. It's fine if I have the clock set off. Sunday. 
Okay, wait, set up time. Select, 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 up, set up date. Oh, this is just like the recom. The recom had, um, it was like 2006. But that's odd. A radio made after 2003 would, wouldn't have the pointy steep and white. I guess it doesn't. Um, right, le okay. Set up date. Whoa. Oops. Uh, 01 Jan. 01, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. What is. It's October 26th. If I'm not mistaken. 27, 26. Alright. Select. If it's not, then I'm stupid. Select. Done. Alright. That is October 26th. Okay, I'm, I'm good. January, January, menu, wait, right, okay, here we go, January, October, select, and then 2006, it's not 2006, ooh, wait, no, 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 I don't want that, I don't want weather yet, ooh, doot, literally doot, you know, here we go, done, next, next, Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Select. Uh. Hmm. Menu. Set up time. How do you set up date? Set up weather channel seven. Um. County code. County code. I don't want county code. I want multiple all counties. Alert mode voice, good. Defeat siren. This is like a this is like a WR three hundred. This is so WR three hundred. Siren high. Ooh, that's loud. Now, backlight continuous. I want that. Add alert. You can add alerts on this too. This is just like a WR three hundred. You can add alerts. Siren test. Ready? You ready for the phone? Three, two, one. Ring, ring. Hello? Oh, hello, Emerson Research. Okay. Next. Wait, no. I just want to hear that. Not threatening at all. Set up time. Set up date. Time siren test. Backlight continuous. Defeat siren. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, I think we're good now. So, set up time. Monday, weather, WB Channel 7. <coughs> Okay, so now, I have my volume, hold on, let's see how, volume's at max now. Okay, so, yes, it works! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. I'm like you, you dang idiot, I'm gonna throw you out. I will actually make a video of me smashing this. Smashing this to pieces, I'm sorry, but I am so pissed at this thing. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move these uh this mid the uh, Midland GXT 1050 and the 1050P over to where the Emerson is the Emerson Emerson blah 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 Um, okay, let's just go right right right. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, ah, four. I would imagine it uses the same battery count as the 12-996, but I come prepared. I will get more if I need to. Okay. Time to put some all batteries into my <laughs> CKW two thousand so I don't lose anything. 
By the way, if nobody, if any of you don't know what the CKW2000 is, this radio is like the ancestor or like the old, the older cousin to the Alertworks EAR10, which SWP is getting for Christmas, I believe. Am I correct? Yep. All right, he's getting that for Christmas, so you're getting a first header cadet, as I call them. My T61 is my first header cadet. This, I believe, uh, do you know what header the CKW2000 activates on? Second, third? I would imagine it activates on third. Because if it doesn't, if it activates on first, then whoa. If it doesn't, then that's fine. All I care is that it works. Unlike my stupid recom, my re which died because it's because it's a stupid piece of ste. Okay, so he's talking to his. I like batteries. Okay, there we go. Now gonna do is still works don't know how long the battery life lasts but oh why isn't the backlight set to continuous all right we're gonna put that there my ck the how does that look that thing's big that thing's big boy big boy fat dude what if i moved my Hold on, wait. What if I move my 261 back there, and then I move that there? How does that look? I don't know. I like the 261 there. Um, yeah, I'll move. I'm going to just keep... I was just going to put the CKW back there. The thing that I don't like about this already, the antenna is not telescopic. So you'd have to like manually move the radio if you want to like get a good signal, which sucks, but that's fine. I mean, this radio was made in like 2006, although this was made in 2004. But this thing has the pretty statement white and the telephone. So, you know, makes up for it. Um, except for this, this, I mean, I guess it's cool, cool, but you know, Still, you die. That's the second recom I've owned. And it died on arrival. Now, this is the power strip that's powering all of it. This is the power brick to my 996. So, don't want to unplug that, though. I did give it new batteries. Also, check it out. I put a Woody's Wash Shack sticker on the top. You can tell me how that looks in the comments. Though I might not take any. All right. This is the adapter to the 261. This is the adapter to the handheld. So we're going to get rid of that. And then we'll move that over to my bed to compensate for the uh, CKW. I'm just going to call it CK for now. I mean, I guess that's what you could call it. A CK, the Emerson CK2000. Well, CKW2000. All right, now... I'm gonna move my handhelds over here next to my Echo Show 5. And we're gonna leave that there real fast. Run the power brick over to my outlet. Boop. Now the radios are charging. Both of them all very nicely snug. Um. Signal loss, KEC-38 has been experiencing some signal loss, apparently. Although, since this antenna is a telescopic, move it back there. But I think just it, it's just having weather signal loss issues. Um, now we're gonna redirect the power, the power brick, power brick over to the, um, here, over here. Oof. Um, does it fit? Does it fit? That's the big question. Does it fit? Does it fit? Let's see. And it... Having issues? Fits. Okay, fits. 
Good, good, it fits. I'm happy. Now, oh gosh, I didn't give it good luck in service. Hold on, let's do that now. Let's do that now. Um. Pretty statement white will compensate for it. Statement whites will always compensate for it. Give me a sec. What's kind of odd is that when you're selecting the channels, I just realized, like, you know, in the 996 and every other radio here, it'll, like, let you know what channel you're selecting. Let's take the Eton FR400, for example. It'll... Uh, yes, SWP? I have a question. What is that? What is that question? Where is the um, Thunderbolt that you found on St. Pete? Oh, the Thunderbolt that I found on St. Pete, Google Municipal Services Center, go into Street View and you'll find the milk, you'll find the milky one. I call it the milky bolt, anyway. Um, Google Municipal Services Center in St. Pete, Google, yeah, Google Municipal Services Center, and then you'll, and then you'll see the milky bolt on the top, or go into Street View and then you'll see the milky bolt, anyway. CKW2000 is not plugged in yet. Get the P brick for it. The P brick. Oh, it is, isn't it? It is. Okay, it's still it's plugged in. Anyway, but yeah, when you're selecting channels, ooh, when you're selecting channels, see, look, cell channel, auto, manual. See, look, channel three, dog. Dad got it, dude. Why are you having horrible signal loss issues? See, look, and then you, you know. Whoa. Municipal Services Center. My computer just had a big major glitch thing. Um, I might replay that. Set up date, set up weather, county code, all, alert mode. Hold on, wait, let's go to weather channel 7. And notice... Oops, wait, wait, wait. Select. Notice there is no um there is no uh broadcast. I find that funny, but um Emerson is probably out of business at this point, so who cares? It's it's a it's a it's a weather radio with a pretty statement white. I'm just gonna keep saying that. What type of what? Oh, it's a 1000 SA1. Yeah, one at the. But it's not jail bar, though. It's not jail bar. Screen's still intact, though. Um. Okay, well. Let's see. 3, 2, 1. Wait. That it. Yeah, that is really loud. I don't know why. Screen is very. That's a that's a lot of words to gulp thin, Paul. Anyway, weather channel seven six five four three, weather channel three. We either channel trace. Now, I'm gonna set this on KEC 38 now. <clears throat> Oops. I'm guessing that since the antenna is very low down, it's stupid. Here we go. Now, let's see. Oh my gosh! I just realized! Screw the screw that the antenna is an ant tell I stop it. Hold on. This one this the antenna on this thing is remo Whoa. Oh it is telescopic. It is telescopic. For some reason it didn't go up all the way. And it was like weird it was odd. It was really odd. Anyway, I thought I think this is removable. I think this one is actually removable. No joke. Um uh, I don't remember, but, oh my gosh, it's really smooth. Very, very, very movable. But, uh, 
Let's see. Perfect, perfect, perfect signal. Perfect. Completely good signal. Um, it's the ra I thought the 996's antenna. Hold on, I'm gonna zoom out. I thought I thought the antenna on the 996 was short, but look at that. Look at how tall that thing is. Look, go down. You can see. And then the F400. FR400 is huge. But on the Emerson, right? The Emerson, excuse me, not Emerson. It's it's pretty short. Pretty short. Um. Uh, what was I gonna say? I was gonna say. Um. Anyway. Yeah. Well. There you go, folks. Now, eventually, I'm gonna make a video of this smashing smash. Uh. Eventually. I'm going to get a hammer to it, sadly. This is odd. Caution, risk of electric shock, do not open. That's new. I've never seen that. Is that pull-offable? Wait a minute. Is this one? Oh, is this, does this have a plastic screen protector? I think it does. I think this radio has a plastic... Hold on, let me... No, it doesn't look like it. I thought it had a plastic screen protector. Anyway, 27 October. I don't know why that's... Anyway, it's right next to the 300, I guess. It's younger brother, because this is a V5. Um, this is a version 13, apparently. Odd. But... This is going to conclude the unboxing slash overview of the Emerson Research CKW2000. I'm TBW563. Uh, see you in the next one. This is going to be in the weekly test tomorrow. Anyways, signing off.